Losing a spider under normal conditions is bad enough. Losing a spider that can change forms is even worse. Um, what are you? Bullet ammo. Uh, thank you. I'm gonna... Ah! God damn it, the gun was a spider too! Everything's a spider! Presented by Tiny Bill. Created by Casey Dunlyle Games. Kill it with fire. Two. Uh, after our little escapades on Earth, uh, destroying, I think, the entirety of the planet, we were kidnapped by spiders. I'm very confused. We were definitely kidnapped by spiders. Days since last spiders, 94. Not from what I remember. Did you pick up the radio? Shh. Oh. Wait, wait. Just a sticky note? Is someone screwing with us? What the hell? The earth is shaking. Where's my gun? Uh, guys, this is not cool. There's a gun in here somewhere. Come on. Everything we went through and there's no gun. Oh, there's another one. Hey, give me your remote. Uh, you're not gonna come in handy. Oh, I think uh, we may have a little trauma from what occurred. Just a little bit. We're back here. The nightmare continues once more. Kill a spider. Uh, here we go again. Get back here, you little bastard. What the hell? They have devil eyes. Oh no. Uh. Fourier is unlocked. I don't know what that means, but okay. Oh. Here's so many spiders. Well, that's a Fourier. Also, why are we being watched? I just noticed the cameras. Uh. Interesting. Racked with Racked with objects to get new Okay, um, uh, yeah, I'm not doing that. Well, yes, I am interacting with objects Specifically by interacting my clipboard with the side of a spider skull Tools of the trade find the tape deck tracker. Oh Hairspray and pistol. Those are our main supplies if you don't remember the first game. This is very strange. Ooh, tracker. Nice. And I'm loving the music. Just stay right there. Back to the drawing board, really. Adjust the whiteboard in the bedroom? What? Sure. Break windows. Oh, look. Whoa. It's a town. Uh, I thought we nuked all of that. Apparently we did. What the hell? It's like a department store? Have we been kidnapped? No smoking. I think smoking's gonna be the least of your problems in a second. Oh, look at that. Get close enough to the window. Lose its effect. I want a plant! Give me a plant. Give me a plant! Holy shit, that worked. <laughs> I got a plant! Fear me now, spiders, for I am plants. <laughs> How did I get a plant in here? I know there's a spider, like... Somewhere around here. <clears throat> 
Yeah, we should update that. This should be the hairspray, right? Oh, we did need a fifth kill! Oh, we upgraded! Fear me! Well, I'm happy. And we can get into the closet now. Hello? That's an upgraded gun. <laughs> That's not quite the revolver we were using before. It looks like something a Winchester would use. Huh. I call this one the 9mm solution. <laughs> Which sounds like innuendo. And... Wait, tape deck? Right, five windows. This may be a bit excessive, but it works. Huh. Shattered expectations. <laughs> uh, so... I guess we were kidnapped by evil spider creatures? What do we got in here? And a tape deck, which was not part of our original equipment. What the hell are you gonna do? Oh, and James your music. That's lovely. Either way. Whatever is waiting on the other d side of this door, I should warn you. These bullets may not be piercing, but they sure as hell will pierce you. Well, take your first step at turning your house into a hymn. Turn, uh, tour our more hymn home finished. Fit. What the hell? Oh, not again! Hide. You guys got me once before, you won't get me again. Ooh! Scratch that. Uh, I don't want to go in there just yet. Oh, um, I can't get out. Oh, I'm trapped. We sure we're like completely trapped? Nope, I'm completely trapped. Oh well. Fine! Take me, Spider Lords. Admittedly, if our situation didn't work out with the, the exterminator has returned. Kill it with fire too. Kill it with spiders. Oh my god, they did not. Love the James Bond X intro. Oh. This is amazing. Love this. Wait, voice cast? There's gonna be voices? Oh, I love this already. They knew exactly what they had to do with the second game. Board the HSF Vindicor? Interdimensional research vessel. What was up with the spiders then? Talk to... Darwin? 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 Uh, okay. Crew 0%, operating capacity 17%, compound X reserve 4%, spider detected error. Okay, lovely. Um, I don't think Darwin is going to be very useful. Hello, as the operating artificial intelligence as of this vessel, I wish to implore your extermination services. Will you accept? Oh! <laughs> we don't get a choice. 
I mean, to be fair, you did kind of kidnap us. Also, we did sort of destroy our planet trying to kill the spiders, so... Not really sure why you want our services in the first place, and so it's not like we got anything to go back to. <laughs> Wait, so we weren't kidnapped by spiders? We were, uh, hired? You have a strange way of hiring people, you know that? Uh, sure. Uh, response documented. Please review the terms and conditions of the proposed employment contract. Uh, let's see. Okay. Spires jumping, spires morphing, spires radioactive, spires and or any spire not a, as yet of discovered. What the hell is a morphing spider? And the core dimensions omega 2, idoid 8, psi 6, lambda 3, and alpha 1. Okay. Multiversal. The Exterminator will be expected to recover data chips and compound X for the client in order to operate the interdimensional space gate and power various blast doors. Okay. <laughs> uh, we'll be retreat the area if pests reappear within 30 standard solar cycles. So 30 days, I guess. The exterminator will perform pest extermination services in a professional and effective manner using appropriate methods and equipment. Not even close, buddy. You'll be lucky this ship works after I'm done. And maintains appropriate insurance coverage. Not quite. And the client shall not hold the exterminator liable for any damages caused during the service. That is very useful considering we do not have insurance because I'm pretty sure our insurance people got ate by spiders. <laughs> uh, it shall be governed by a read all of Darwin's contracts. <laughs> Sign. Very good. You're in... Invoice may be submitted upon completion of the service. Report to the monitoring labeled campaign status for further instructions. Okay, I'm not gonna listen to it again. Okay, let's go find our way to uh, command wing. Okay, I see how it is. Of course it explodes, and of course I'm immune. Should I get started in here? The source of the spider invasion resides in the Dimension Alpha-1. The Vindicor is equipped with an interdimensional space gate capable of transporting you to that dimension. So we're like Doomslayer then. Air interdimensional space gate of one of those oh, currently experiencing malfunctions. I can imagine. How irritating. To open a gateway to Alpha-1, we will need to recover a data chip containing coordinates for that dimension. Lovely. Unfortunately, most of our data chips were strewn across the neighboring dimensions during the spider's assaults on the Vendicar. Uh, reporting to the uh, monitor labeled vessel status for further instructions. Consider your, this your final contingency performance test. Wait, cognitive? What the hell are you saying? You saying something's wrong with me? How the, how the hell do you think I do this job? I do this job by having something wrong with me. Uh, okay, I want whatever's in there. Congratulations on deploying so. Yes, please, with the confetti. Air celebratory confetti of is one of 39,242 systems currently experiencing malfunctions. Come on, the spiders got the confetti too! Damn it! Also, do you really want me to handle this? The last time I handled things. I nuked a town. Sorry, habit. Many of the Vandegar systems are powered by a crystallized fuel source known as Compound X. That's also, I'm pretty sure, what made the Powerpuff Girls. <laughs> like the dad chip, the spider dad chips, the spiders have scattered our supplies of Compound X across the neighboring dimensions. Take the X crystal from the container nearby and use it to power out the bridge's blast doors. If you can recover additional compound ets, I should be able to restore functionality to several of the Vandicor systems that you may find helpful. The interdimensional space gate is located in the hangar. Proceed with caution. Have you seen the way I do things? I don't proceed with caution. Caution proceeds with me. And compound X. 
kind of looks like a buffalo. So far, so good. Haven't been attacked by an alien just yet. Uh... Should I, uh, I, um... Oh! I see. Before, we just got our tasks whenever we enter an area, but now our tasks are strewn about the area itself. Kill more spiders. Collect audio logs. Okay, I see. What is that noise? And return the weights to the rack. One of these things is not like the other. Speak to the highly advanced intelligence system. Kill morphine spires, collect audio logs, which could give us hints as to what to do. And then return the weights to the weight rack. Because that's so important in the middle of an interdimensional spider invasion. What the hell? What the hell is that? I tried to put the weight on the rack and the r weight decided it didn't want to do such. Where did it go? Losing a spider under normal conditions is bad enough. Losing a spider that can change forms is even worse. Um, what are you? Food ammo. Uh, thank you. I'm gonna- ah! God damn it, the gun was a spider too! Everything's a spider! I'm scared to- Ah, come on! What the hell? Why is everything a spider? It was bad enough when there was spiders everywhere, but now I can't even pick things up without them being spiders. Where did it go? I'm scared to touch anything else. Okay, you're real. Okay, you're real. Oh, I'm gonna have nightmares. Ah, come on! Why are- oh, You son of- The developers made- Where is it? The developers made- The developers made both the really cool space weapons Sitting out in the open air! Spiders! We're gonna stop with the more cautious methods. Yep! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Every single weapon around here is a spider! The ping pong ball was a spider! Hey, you're in plain sight. You're alive?! Jesus. You guys really need to stop doing that. I'm bad enough as it is. We unlocked one of the lockers. Which gets us... Com compound X? I was hoping for a weapon. Hey, Darwin. Don't hesitate to come to me if you require additional information. You're only human after all. Hey! Um... Tapes? Habit, sorry. Have an obsession with documenting their own experiences, whether it be through journals, songs, or conversate uh conventional other means. Uh you can use the tape deck to investigate them. Interesting. I've yet to find any audio tapes, I think. Yeah, I haven't found any audios. Do I seem a little more fidgety than normal? Um that's mostly because Oh, wait. Haven't seen any of them, he says. Meanwhile, there's one right there. Okay. Announcement from the bridge. I would like to talk to all of you today about sacrifice. Oh. On gate day, as our species prepared to embark on its first interdimensional journey, our enemy executed its most diabolical attack since the infestation of our planet. How they managed to infiltrate an entire fleet, we'll never know. 
But something else you may not know is that my own brother was the officer who sent the Mayday from the HSF Santa Maria. And I was the officer who ordered it shot down. Ooh. The human space fleet destroyed 90% of its own forces that day, and in spite of that sacrifice, our enemy still managed to commandeer our ships and escape through the gate. So was it worth it? Most would say no. But I say not yet. Why? Because we can still win this if we all Make the sacrifice. Announcement concluded. Emotional support bagels are available <laughs> in the break room. Emotional support bagels are the least of our concerns right now. Okay, that dude was completely off the deep end. Luckily enough, I've not been given my high explosives yet, so I'm yet to actually destroy anything. You know, this weight's a little burnt, which means it has been checked. I didn't think to look in here. Oh yeah, I, sh I should have thought about that. Also, am I, is, am I crazy or does the music definitely resemble Doom? Oh, that one actually is a gun. It's a gun. <laughs> Damn it. I've already... Right, music. I've already lo Okay, this is like triple what there was before. How lovely. I've already lost the developers. They already have me questioning everything. I set my new gun on fire because I thought it was a spider. Audio tape. I saw something. Officer Dan Reynolds going on record again with a list of complaints I would like to file against my fellow crew members. You'll find my reports detailed and alphabetically ordered, but allow me to save you some time. My team and I did not go through the trouble of transferring Darwin to the most technologically advanced vessel of all time just so a bunch of dullards could use him to play video games. <laughs> At this rate, we're going to have to start reallocating compound X just to keep up with the power demand. What we do here is gravely serious business. It's an interdimensional war against a race of super spiders for crying out loud. He's not wrong, but he is wrong. There we go. Found the final weight. And we get... Compound X. You know, normally when I complete these tasks and open up something like this, it was, you know, rocket launcher, nuclear war codes, uh, stuff of that sort. Compound X is boring and doesn't explode. Laser pistol, laser pistol, laser pistol! We're okay. I'm okay. Huh. Aw. <laughs> I wanted to just hide in the box until it was over. <laughs> Who needs money when you have your life? Uh, can we launch escape pod 5? Oh, there's a final tape. Okay, let's be careful about that. Something a little more practical. Chief Science Officer Sabrina Buon, cycle 35. At 0600 hours, survey teams 4, 5, and 6 embarked on a standard IDSG scouting mission for the Vindicator's next jump point. At 17 minutes on the mission clock, we received an all green from team 4. Ensign Lagari wrote off the report as an error, but identical reports continue to arrive at 49 second intervals. I checked the report's additional comment section where it appeared Team 4 had written, We are not being controlled by parasitic life forms, so come on over. Uh. I miss the dimension with the talking hamsters. I'm sorry, what? I love that. We're gonna send you into this alternate dimension area and we have no clue what's there. Good luck! More comments. 
I know I need the compound X, and you know, it's good for me to get things over and dealt with and handled <laughs> around here. But still, come on. I don't need compound X, I just need explosives and fire and everything else I used. Hangar bay. You know, oftentimes when I open a door and see something like a tank sitting right there, it has a tendency to just turn its turret towards me. Which is a lot of T's and a lot of pain. But I guess not. Can I have the tank? I want a hover tank. I want the hover tank! <laughs> Don't get a hover tank. Of course they're not going to give me a hover tank. That would be... Easy, I think. Uh, I'll get back to you, Darwin. Oh, rewards. Oh, specialty rewards. So this is our main transportation hub, then. Chief Science Officer Sabrina Bulan, cycle 35. At 0600 hours, survey team... There we go, it was the coffee mug! Not my friend, not the coffee mug! Seventeen minutes on the okay. mission clock. We received uh, an all green. Stop. Uh, hey Darwin, don't mind don't mind the fire nor the sparking console. I'm doing more damage to this ship than I am good. Uh, this terminal controls the interdimensional space gate, providing you access to dimen to the dimensions across all of time and space. Uh, please, no more than thirty seconds to admire its complexity. Ah, lovely. I mean, to be fair, I need less than 30 seconds to admire complexity and finish, so situation's handled. <laughs> Given the recent damage suffered by the indicator subsystems, the interdimensional space gates power systems will need to be manually debugged. Was that a joke, or do you mean that literally? I believe that falls under your pre purview. I mean, it depends on how you mean it. Do you mean squash, burn, and crucify every eight-legged freak in this and all dimensions? Or do you mean system software, which I don't have a good history with doing without breaking something at the same time? Uh, I des uh, designated two different user interfaces for this test. Please select the option that you believe matches your some problem. Solving abilities. Easy, hard, easy, hard. Let's go for hard. Uh... There we go. Saw the hard version of Darwin's puzzle. Well done on an unrelated note. I would like to remind you that you are not being paid by the hour. Excuse me? To travel to another dimension, you will need a data chip that contains relative coordinates. Relative? Relevance, not relative. Okay. Uh, the coordinates for dimension 5-6 are encoded on a data chip in the container near this terminal. Uh, that wouldn't happen to be this thing, right? Uh, click the data chip, then return to this terminal to activate the gates. Okay. So, I'm guessing you, then. Ah, data chip. Nice, you got data chip. I'll get right on that. There's another container over here I want to open. I uh, got your chip. My sensor said detected an abnormality. At normal concentration, it expires with an structure known as the Arduous Manor. Also, with a human space fleet data chip. Oh. Remember that any and all paranormal anomalies have a logical explanation. Retrieve the data chip and return to the, the interdimensional space gate is now open. Please proceed with caution. I'm sorry, did you just say paranormal? Oh, is it the spiders trying to crawl up her ass? Wasn't bad enough. Now we're gonna have a ghost <laughs> trying the exact same thing. That looks like an inviting hole. Let's go in very, very gently. Very gently. There we go. It's wondering when we were actually gonna go in. Eh, 
And we're in a haunted house. Find the stolen data chip. Artois Manor, Dimension 56. Right now, I'm gonna leave this episode of Kill It With Fire 2 off here. Oh, uh, I can't believe we're actually doing <laughs> I can't believe this game actually came out. Like, I, I, I don't remember seeing anything about it. I don't remember seeing anything about this game coming out and then just suddenly, hey, Kill It With Fire 2 came out. Well, actually, no. I saw stuff about it coming out a long time ago. I just didn't know it was gonna come out anytime soon. Either way. This has been a lot of fun. I love this. Um, if you want to uh, watch my previous playthrough of Kill with Fire, then there will be a playlist down in the description where you can watch that, as well as a playlist for any future episodes of this. Um, also a Discord where you can talk about the series and everything about it that you love <laughs> so dearly. Uh, yeah. Other than that, uh, think about it, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and look at stuff for that. Be good, be one. I'll see all of you in the next episode. Goodbye. Chief Science Officer Sabrina Bulan, cycle 35, at 0600 hours, survey teams 4, 5, and 6, embarked on a standard IDSG scouting mission for the Vindicator's next jump point. At 17 minutes on the mission clock, we received an all green.